Hello students once again welcome to Bhulanath Academy in this video students we are going to see the problem based on chemical kinetics question 10 in question 10 students you have rate of the reaction the rate already here students the rate of the reaction we are going to show with capital R the rate of the reaction that this is the reaction students 2 times A combines with 1 times B and it gives you 2 moles of C and 1 mole of D ok students the rate of the reaction this reaction is given to you that is 6 into 10 is to minus 4 mole per dm cube per second ok students and the concentration of A and B is given 0.3 mole per dm cube both the concentrations are same students if the reaction is first order the students here very important first order in A and zeroth order in B what is the rate constant the rate constant we are again we are going to show with K students so you have to find the rate constant K now here the students you have to apply the rate law when you apply the rate law to this reaction students then only you will find the rate constant ok students so what happens students when you apply the rate constant here the coefficient of A is not important students here the reactant A and B how many reactants are there there only we are going to apply the rate law so here students two reactants are there A and B coefficient is not applied students coefficient is not important here because we are going to apply the rate law when you apply the rate law students so here the rate of the reaction is equals to small k that is the rate constant it is the product of the all these three quantity that is the it is the product of the rate constant and the concentration of a and the concentration of b and its power this is x we have taken and here in general we are going to take y okay students when you apply the rate law to these two reactants students so only two reactants are there so here the rate of the reaction is equals to rate is equals to k into product of the concentration of a raised to x into the concentration of b raised to y okay students now what is else is given students here the concentrations value is given that is 0.3 mole per dm cube rate of the reaction is also given and here students first order order of the reaction x and y is nothing but the order order of the reaction of a and b is already given now just put the value students and find the value of k now students what will be the k here if you want to find the k here the k is nothing but you have to divide this whole equation to r so r rate of the reaction you have to divide with concentration of a raised to x into concentration of b raised to y okay students now students just put the value students here the rate of the reaction is given to you the rate of reaction is given 6 into 10 raised to minus 4 mole per dm cube per second okay students you have to divide this value by concentration of a is already given that is 0.3 mole per dm cube and order students order is here x value is given here x is given to you 1 and y is given that 0th is nothing but 0 okay students so which raised to x 1 and students again b 0.3 mole per dm cube raised to 0 anything raised to 0 will be always 1 so this value is going to be become 1 okay students rate constant will be 6 into 10 raised to minus 4 mole per dm cube per second this rate of the reaction we have to divide with 0.3 mole per dm cube and the anything raised to anything raised to 0 will be always 1 ok students now you have similar terms you have to cancel students mole will cancel with mole dm cube will cancel with dm, DM cube now students here you have to divide this can be written as 6 into 10 raised to minus 4 per second you have to this 3 can be written as 3 can be make positive by 10 raised to minus 1 by dividing 10 raised to minus 1 ok students now what happens students you can divide 3 1s are 3, 3 2s are 6. Okay, students, this 10 is to minus 1 will cancel. The 10 is to minus 3 will be there. Okay, students. So you will got the value students 2 into 10 is to minus 3 per second. This is the value of rate constant in this question, students. So this is where you have to find the value of rate constant. Very simple way I have explained, students. For two marks, students, in board examination, they are asking. This is very simple, students. This way you have to proceed the answer, students. If you like my video, please share it, subscribe it. Thank you, thank you very much. Have a nice day. God bless you.